hold to unlock. Hoping it's worth it. So I rarely see these things. <gasps> Whoa! All right, we're back, folks. And I did a little redecorating in our castle. In fact, I pretty much revamped the whole entire place. Now, of course, we are in our master bedroom at the moment. I don't know why I put that casket over here. But anyway, in between this video and the last one, I decided to like take some time and redo or enhance our castle as a whole. As you can see on the second floor, there's not much decoration yet. I'm going to do that over time, but our castle looks much, much different. As you can see, this is the throne room here or the place we sit and do our planning to send our servants out. I am making this room a library room. I'm slowly building it out as well as I put a you know landing here to see out into the open. It's a work in progress, but I got rid of the, the, the two stairs and just had a single staircase here. And of course, this is the main entryway, which of course I'll be adding more decoration here as well. I also got a prison room, which I'm currently working on and I've gotten one servant so far, which I've been extracting her blood. I just need to get some glass containers to actually pull the blood. That's why I haven't tapped the blood from the prisoner yet. But we have three prison cells so far and I do plan on filling them in. Back here, of course, is where we create a bunch of stuff with our materials. I separated the rooms uh, based on the type. So here is the workshop room where we carve up and grind up our stuff as well as, you know, work working bench, woodworking bench, I mean, over there. And then over here, this is going to be the tailoring room. Now, I don't have the floor panels for the tailoring yet. I have to unlock it. I have to find the recipe. But yeah, I do plan on getting that in the future. This room is the alchemy room, which not much here yet, but we do have an alchemy table as well as the vermin nest over here. And then this is the, I guess, smithing furnace room where we, you know, do our furnishing. So yeah, that's pretty much it, I believe. We only have one entrance now. Well, we have two entrances. That over here is the, this is the front entrance right here. And this is the back entrance where we, if we exit out here, we can use our castle way gate to teleport all over. So but we won't be doing that at the moment. So my plan for this video is to now take on the level 47 V blood targets. And our first target is Maja, the dark savant, because she has the ability or the recipe to make a study. And I want that badly. So let's go ahead and be on our merry way. So I, she says she's very far away, so. Actually, I'd probably go go the other way for this. Do we still have our horse? Yes, we do have our horse. I'm gonna hold, take our horse. The door. And uh, yeah, let's get on our way. The Forbidden Tower. Okay. I didn't even see this on a map. Is anybody else here? At least it's inside, so we don't have to worry about oh, much blood. She's by herself. Oh, okay. This is going to be a. What level? She's 47. We are 48. I think we'll be fine. She's probably gonna be tough. All right, let's do this. No one will hinder my research. Shut up. Oh, and papers at us? What? Get out of here with that. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is easy. This is easy peasy. Oh, she's going to be hard. She's not. Okay. 
heal back. Rise, oh, what? Accept what? Rise what? Huh? Huh? <laughs> okay. Here is some mandatory reading. Give me I got, okay. your life, my minion. Oh, see, he's absorbing the minions for health. I imagine a power. Damn it. Is oh, this is annoying. Reading. A taste of knowledge. To me. We got that situated. Doing good so far. Lend me your power. Why is the sound going out for her for some reason? Let me teach you something. You gotta die, bro. You gotta die. I'm gonna blast her to death. Now you're dead. You're dead. Get out of here. No, you weren't. You were way off. Alright, we got her done. That was, that was pretty fun. I feel stronger. Alright. So what did we get? A brilliant obsessive scholar that resides in an ancient family library. Discovering its long lost secrets in pursuit of a goal intuitively <laughs> passed through her family's bloodline. The culmination of generations of work is at her ink stained fingertips to open a way to the world of demons. All right. So we got another illusion spell point. Study. Of course, that's what I wanted this whole time. Verdant garden fencing, wall hanging shelves, scroll and midnight ball gown. Okay, so we get a, a gown or suit and pants. All right. Nice. All right, cool. I'm going to head back to the castle, but our next probably targets will be Leandro, the Shadow Priestess, and Krieg. I don't want to get Krieg. That's the re Ooh. Unlocks the ability to craft Reapers. I kind of want that. What does she give you? I'll do... Well, we're going to do both anyway. I'll probably do Krieg first, but... Oh yeah. Wait, let's see what spell we have. I'm probably just gonna put it onto the Wrath Spear, dash towards input direction and launch a piercing projectile to dealing 160% magic damage and inflicting weaken. Each subsis subsequent hit deals 75% damage of the previous hit and grants phantasm. I'll unlock it. All right, we are back in our castle. So I'm gonna actually make this study. Do I have enough materials to make it? I believe I, I should have enough research. So I need eight reinforced plank and eight cloth. I, I know I have the cloth, uh, cloth, but the plank I may need to like make so this will be, oh, this is pretty big, actually. Let me move that out the way first. This out here for now. I put this right here, yeah. And then I'll put this press right here. Yeah, all right, let's see what we can make. I need 75 scrolls. Okay, good to know. We can make that though, right? Yeah. That's neat. Oh, fuck. I need to make paper. 
Okay, so I'm gonna have to go for an ingredient run, material run at some point. So for now, let's go and get to this Greek guy. Actually, first I need blood. Let me find someone to be a victim for us. Who in the fuck is that? By the Velmont name, I will vanquish you! That looks, that sounds like a paladin. I've never seen that guy here ever around this area before. And the music is different too. Let's see if anyone's here after. Okay, there's a warrior here for 31%. That was interesting. Do they, over time, like, upgrade the areas and have, like, new people just running around? That's kind of cool, actually. Yeah, I've been in this area for so long, I've never seen that guy before, ever. I think he's in here. Ooh, okay, skeleton mage. Die. Ooh, he looks like a badass. Holy shit. Look at these people. Yeah, he's gonna be tough. I already feel it. Is he summoning people or is he does a counter? Come on, stupid. Good, I'm trying to reflect while I'm healing. Oh, if I hit him, then he summons. Okay, that's very good to know. I may die here. Yeah, I'll retreat back for now. From my veins, I rejuvenate. Oh, God, God, stop shooting. God damn. Actually. Oh, he stopped it. Oh, that got interrupted. Oh, okay. All right. Oh yes, two for the price of one. Yes, I love this. 
Yes, two two of them fighting one at a time. I don't care who dies first, don't either one of them die. He's down. He's at half right now. No, ah, fuck. I keep remember I can't do that. Actually, I'm gonna take I'm gonna take his heart blood right now, since I'll, I'll be invulnerable to getting hit. That's a lot of damage to him. Nope, not this time, fucker. worked out perfectly. I wrote it up myself. Taking out two V blood targets at once. Well, kind of at once. It's probably the strat to take them both out, actually. The easier strat, at least. Alright, Phantom Tournament. Sullied Heart. Merciless. What is that? Merciless Whip. Oh, Merciless. Okay, these are the ones... Whip? We can use a whip as a weapon? Okay. Okay. I think, though, with merciless weapons, you need the original weapon first in order to get the uh, merciless version. All right. So we killed Krieg, a truly impressive strategic mind in life. Krieg saw an early end for his unmistaken faith in his allies. Though he was sent to an unjust grave, he was like any great mastermind and had contingencies in place for just such an occasion. A dark deal with an entity of undeath allowed him to rise again and take his revenge. Now he serves the cult of the damned with renewed purpose, fully immersing himself into the enigmatic cause. So we can summon skeleton priests, reapers, we've got point. Then what was her? She's up next here. Meredith the Bright Archer. Meredith is a true believer in the Church of Luminance. She believes her power is a gift from the light to wield against dark forces such much as the original paladins were given the light to strike down Dracula and the vampire legions. As brave as she is naive to the church's descent into avarice and gluttony, this holy archer is blinded by the light focused only on her pursuit of justice at any cost. So we get Holy Resistance Potion and Storm, Storm Spell Point. Okay. Let's get out of here and prepare to go for our final. Well, it's not really our final, our next V-Blood target. So, let's see, we got this, storm magic. Harness lightning and thunder to lay waste to your foes. Become electricity itself crackling between your enemies while you bring down the full fury of the storm. Ooh, electrify your enemy for five seconds, causing physical damage dealt to them and to trigger a shock dealing 10% magic damage. Triggers a chain lightning effect traveling towards the nearest enemy dealing 50% magic damage, inflicting static and bounce up to two times when the target affected by static perishes. Okay, cyclone. Oh, that's what static does. Cyclone, conjure a cyclone that pierces enemies dealing 90% magic damage and inflicting static. The cyclone returns once it reaches max distance, circling back towards you and lingering up for eight seconds, hitting any enemy it passes through. I may most likely pick that one. Ball lightning. Launch a ball lightning that lingers in place, periodically shocking nearby enemy flicking static. Deals up to 
180% magic damage per target over three seconds. Ball lightning's total damage cannot exceed 450% magic damage. Explodes after duration dealing 50% magic damage in the area. That's also pretty good too. Discharge, block melee and projectile attacks for up to 1.5 seconds. Blocking an attack pulls the target towards you and grants one storm shield. Enemies targeting discharge in close vicinity are stunned for 0.8 seconds. Storm shields circle around you dealing 20% magic damage and inflicting static. Effect stacks up to three times. I may actually just go with ball lightning for now. Then place this one now. Even though that mosquito is pretty damn good. What is his now? We got. Okay. Death Knight summons what summon a Death Knight at target location that attacks nearby enemies. Each swing deals 50% magic damage in an area and inflicts condemned. The Death Knight lasts for six seconds. That is pretty sick. Veal of Bones dash towards input direction and lose nearby enemies for 2.2 seconds. Your next primary attack heals you for 5% of your maximum health and inflicts condemned and summons a skeleton warrior. Ooh, that's pretty good too. That's really good. Veal of Bones, dash towards, oh wait, no, I just saw that. Soul Burn, drain the life of nearby, from up to near, three nearby enemies dealing 70% magic damage and inflicting condemned and leeching 50% health. It cancels any attack and the enemy performs silence in them. Oh, it has silence? I want to try. Death Knight. I want to try the Death Knight. Let's try out the Death Knight. See how it goes. See if we like it. And then we have. Okay, so my real big goal, we maybe we will get it here. My goal is to actually kill Grethel the glass blower eventually pretty soon because she can make glass you know, we'll be able to make glass and I need glass to be able to make these damn containers for blood unless I find a, a glass container out there but we gotta first take out a Leandra the shadow priestess but before we do that before we do that I want to see about this merciless set Oh, wait, no, it's not here. Is it here? Smithy? Iron. Oh, I want to make this too. Okay, I need iron ingots and six planks. Where are all my. What? Oh, I need. Okay, my iron ingots were in the saw. I believe. Yes, they are. Take you two actually. Actually, I gotta put I have a study now, so I have all these books that we can study from. Let's just go over there real quick and use our study. Still need a bunch of scrolls, though. I gotta make them. I'll be doing that in between this session and next for sure. All right. That's crazy. You can get a whip. Crimson Temps Templar gloves. Taylor flooring. Yes. Yes. I wanted that so badly. Okay. So I think we've gotten all of them. Can I do that now? Hold on. Taylor. What do we need? Okay. We have enough. Oh, that's an ugly color. Can I switch that? <laughs> Let's switch that to like blue. This will yeah. not work. Ah, uh, okay. Well, we'll do that later. I'll switch it later. Okay, so 
What's this? Scourge Stone. Magical component used for crafting magical objects. <gasps> Wait a minute. We were able to... Oh no, we're going to be doing that for Leandra once we kill her. Well, she has a thing we can unlock. To craft. Um... Here, I'll put this in there for now. Yeah, we'll get to here. Oh, we can, we can make the iron axes at least. Three greater blood as essence and three reinforced plank. I can't make the iron bow though. I need an iron. I don't know where to get an iron whip from. We can make the axes, which. Are great. Actually, I need to make then. All right. Oh, don't tell me I have no more planks unless I put it in another. I probably put it in another box. I realize it. No. We really ran out of planks? I never thought I'd see today. That's crazy. Alright, we need to get some planks being made. Alright. Alright, so we've crafted the merciless iron axes, which I believe now we are level 50. Yes, level 50 gear level. Probably does a lot more damage in comparison to the other melee weapons. And in addition, we've gotten the Iron Reaper 2, which is pretty cool. It's a nice spin attack, and then we can aim, throw, like, that's really cool as well, so. Um, I think now that we are there at level 50, we can more easily take out Leandro, which we are going after right now, and then afterwards we're gonna go after these last two, and then see where we end up at. So let's do that. It's just came nighttime, so we need to head out now. You know what I mean? Fuck it. Well, I'll just carry those with us. Let's just go. Church of the Damned. What's up, suckers? The sky. Got it here. Shut up, die. Get that grave dust. All right, and then what's oh, my other earbud? Here. Nice. Here I push up. Yeah, just die, dude. Okay. So far, so good. I really like that electric boat. I think it's really, really strong. You, you know, I've said this in previous videos and for other games, but when you're playing a game for a while and you get used to controls, get to a point where you like start feel it. You know, like you're just feeling starting to feel like a badass, and I'm starting to feel like that right now. The stronger we get, but as I say that. Out of here. That should be better. That, that should be better. I wonder how the cyclone will look too. Or be. Let 
you just die. Thank you very much. Brave dust. What up, suckers? What's up? All right, let's get all purple. Hail storm crystal. All right, so they're by themselves. So, Leandra, Shadow Priestess, let's do this. The bright, the dark. Some fuckery shit. Oh, oh, okay, okay, oh, okay, okay. Why? Right. Now to use this. Oh, this blinds you? Holy shit, okay. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Fuck. Oh. Couldn't tell where we're at. Shit, shit, that's a lot of damage. Fuck. God damn it, I had you. I had you. I can feel the shadows consume me, but they will take you first. Moving, keep moving. Ow. God damn, that they do so much damage. This time, buddy. That was a close one too, but the price of power. I probably was better off fighting melee with her because she does she's she's a magic wielder, but still. I like the bow and arrow a lot in this game. A lot, as you can tell. Okay. Get all our shit back to. Yeah, we've now cleared every person on this level. There are few creatures on the face of Vardarin as ancient as Leandra. Mysterious and surrounded with shadow magic and un undeath. It is said that when Dracula fell and the poisonous blood rain soaked Vardarin, she stood willingly in the deadly downpour. Some say she embraced the dark power of that corruption and made it her own. Today she serves as high priestess of the cult of the damned. Okay. We got a number of things. We could make scourge stone pendant, which is good. Artisan table, which will probably make it there. Then dust caller, summon a swarm, basset transport, 
subdued human back to the nearest unoccupied prison cell within your realm. <gasps> That's really fucking cool. All right, so let's head back to the castle and then we're going to head off to face off these two if we have enough, actually. All right, we are back in our castle. And I wanted to check out what we got for our spell points in here, so we can get something new here, which I was kind of getting thinking about the Ward of the Dam. I remember seeing that earlier. Ward of the Dam, block melee and projectile attacks in front of you for two seconds. This is the same ability that that other uh, Bee Blood uh, target we killed earlier was doing. It's absorbing an attack summons a skeleton, which is really nice. I'm actually gonna go with that. Screw it. I know we have. We, I think we have a um a spell jewel to attach to it too. But right now, I like the setup we have for our current spells. So, all right, I'm gonna now try to build this artisan. T is, ooh. We don't have enough scourge stones. Right, I don't think we have Yeah, we don't have enough scourge stones. Unless I put one here somewhere. No. I thought I did. But I didn't. Oh, there's a book here. Get that to the study. And actually. <gasps> oh, yes, foul finger. That's why we had a higher one up. But let me. Sure, we don't have a higher one? Oh, that's a soul burn. That's what we have. Alright. Well. <laughs> in there. We don't have any of those yet, so. Um, mm -mm. no, 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 okay, where would the artisan go, oh, it's just a level one, now these gloves are stronger than the ones we have right now, It's actually upgrade from the hollow things we are currently wearing. And I do have, I think I have thick like our leather, right? No, oh, I, I have the hide, but I don't know if I can make the thick leather. No, I can't because it's not unlocked yet. God damn it. All right. You want to make you though, and I will make you one day soon. I just need a thick leather. Still, we are going to go head out to that, kill those other individuals. Seven. You can actually. And that's. We do have one, okay. Just wondering. Increases damage by 22%. Shield nearby allies 47% of your spell power when mosquito is summoned. Nice. Um, 
The thing I like about the mosquito also is it fears your enemies away once it explodes, which is really nice. But roll with the electric ball right now. Electric balls are really cool too. It's really nice, good to have. It's also just hard to like pick between all these spells that we get, you know. All right. Um. I don't think we can build anything else besides. I really want to make this. We don't have enough scourge. Uh, how do we make scourge stones? Actually, we have to just go back to that place to like farm them. I guess. I don't know. I guess we just gotta farm those um undead commanders that we saw earlier. And I think we can teleport over there, so I'm going to, like, quickly go over there. Either these undead enemies are spreading, or we're just getting into a different area. into the shade. Get out of here. I do like these axes a lot. Always did. Especially because they're technically my strongest weapon right now. Until we upgrade. Has a commander right there. Or I think that's a commander or just a guardian. Oh, wait, not commander. I, I keep thinking these guys are. Okay. That's not good. They're all. What? Shit, that doing a fuck ton of damage. Summon one too, fucker. Yeah, okay, we got a sc scourge stone. I only needed one. Oh, no one, sucker. All right, let's get back to the castle. We are done here. Oh God, no, no, no. In my abyssal sight, every heartbeat echoes. Every time I get close to those caravans, I always die. Generation. Oh, 
die. Now, oh, I was rudely interrupted. What's in this caravan? Hold to unlock. Hoping it's worth it. I rarely see these things. <gasps> Whoa! Holy shit, Marksman Composite Bow. Shout out to sh the shards of a magical weapon, unusable in its current state, bring to an ancestral forge to restore. What the hell is ancestral forge? Oh my god, that's fucking dope. Okay, taking all this shit. Okay, so these caravans are very much worth it. Really cool. And we are back once again, and now we should be able to build one. So we need f um sixteen iron ingots, which they are over here. Just take it all. Fuck it. Oh. No wonder, okay, I can't carry anything else. Put this over here so I can make some more. And then... And there. That glass in here, I believe. Oh. Maybe it's in, yes, in here, okay. I actually almost have enough glass to upgrade our castle in general to like level three, which I've been wanting to do too. But, um, garlic resistant potions, which I love to see. Okay, where is this? It's not in there. Not here yet. There it is. Okay. I need the blood, greater blood essence, like I said. I'll put this in here. Alright, now to build this. Where do we build this at? I'm just gonna build it here just for now. And then see what it goes. Okay, I need jeweler jeweler's chamber flooring. Okay. So we're gonna have to build yet another room for jewelers. I mean, I could turn this area to a room, but I, I could, but I want to keep it downstairs. I may actually cut the prison in half because I don't think I need this much room for a prison. Yeah, I might be, I might do that. Okay, so now split up the areas for now. We got the prison over there, which I think that's enough. I may just build. Actually, can I build one more cage? For the time being, I need reinforced plank. But I'll put it. I'll put another cage here for four. Maybe another one on the side. I oh, know they can't reach. I may. Mm, I may. Actually, I could do that right now. So I don't think I need this much room for. The jeweler's location. Like that. Then I'll put yet another cage here. So my goal is to make a uh, capture five individuals with a hundred percent blood, one being rogue, warrior, yada yada yada. So for now, we'll just do it this way. I may like restructure it later, but still. All right, bone ring. Okay, I, I want to make this. This is what I want to make. Eight scourge stones and 24 gem dust. Yo, fuck. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right. Um. In any event, let's see. Let's get to Grethel. I want to kill Grethel. That is my next target. To kill Grethel. Alright. Grethel needs to die. 
All right. Um. Very far away. I'm gonna put some of this stuff away and then head out. By the time we were, it's going to be daylight, but it's whatever. That in there. For this, actually, we'll put this radium alloy. I just realized that. Void sanguine coal. All this stuff I don't even have right now. Yeah, actually, let me take this back. That in there. And start throwing some of this shit. This. Alright, we are ready to go. Let's see, Grethel. Glass blow. Let's head there now. Alright, I believe she's in here somewhere in the quartz quarry. Oh god, okay. I need to find a place to. Okay, I can sit down here, I guess. Fine. Need the feed too. The glass bottle. What am I doing? Give this guy the win. Yeah, I, I could have died right there. From my veins, I, my blood reserves run low. I know your blood reserves run low. There's a road right here to kill. It get that empty bottle we've been looking for. I guess it's fine now. Come here. All right, let's find this woman now. I think, I believe it's a woman. I uh, let's find this person. Ports here too, considering. Dead. The sow also there. I might as well just farm some. Ports while we're here too. Good to know that there's a mine that's mainly quartz. There's a warrior there. I killed him. Fuck. She and uh, I, she's not working. You're an idiot. That was stupid. You deserve to die from that. Okay. Anything in here? Just a furnace. Actually, also need to. Consider making a garden to plant some of these seeds that I've gotten so far. We have a couple back at the castle. Snowflowers. Jeez. 
be down here? Sanguine regeneration. She a demolisher, it's a warrior. Actually, let me take these guys out like this. Out of here. Get out of here. You're dead. You just burned yourself alive. You're done. Take that, though. Reaper. Swimming in some quartz back at home. Bro, get away from me. Get away from me. I will kill you. I guess you want to die. Stay away from me. I wasn't bothering you at all. She's down here somewhere. Probably around this mound of stone. Move out the way. I said move. I told you to move. She's up the stairs, probably. Come out away. I know y'all just doing your job, but uh, you, you see a vampire, I would stop doing all work and just leave. That's it for my day. I would never, like, stay. <laughs> That's so dumb. Or someone just wielding a big ass mace like I am. That you're not familiar with. Just, just, just go home. Let's go home. Okay, some people coming up down here. Away. <laughs> Made him shoot himself. And they stand in the fire like dummies. Like, who trained y'all? So dumb. Oh, there are, she's in there. So she probably does that with the... All right. Now let's head in. See what okay, she's in there by herself. So good. My blood restore. Hello, my Gretel. Body. I need your blood. Do you mind me taking it? You just made a big mistake. These arms aren't just for crap. Oh, fuck. I gotta remember those shields, they do shit. You summon lava? Oh, fuck. 
Okay, this isn't good. Actually, let me restart. Heal up real quick. Come here. If you break something in here, I'll break you. You're a real piece of work. Shit. That was actually good. Shit. It's not good at all. Afraid of the heat. Impressed. This is nothing. Oh, it's a little cut. So she blows that up. Does that do they explode? Oh, they're class shards. That's pretty cool. A few birds build character. Yes. Interesting boss. This is nothing. What's a little You're a real piece of work. What? Should have waited till she did her move, then shot it. Shatter! These arms aren't just for crap. Fuck. Afraid of the heat? We got her. These are... Good fight. Good duel. Give me your butt now. That was a lot of fun. It's a bit, uh, a bit difficult during, due to like the area being kind of small, but uh, yeah, we did it. So what did we get? A true artist with a deep love for the process of creation. She thinks of herself much like she thinks of her glass. It is beautiful and practical, chaotic and tame, strong and yet delicate. In the same way, her style of glass blowing is methodical and daring. While she is the master of her craft, she wears many savage burn scars for her haphazard approach. Okay, so we got another spell point in Storm, wall hanging mirrors, which I don't know if we'll have a reflection, uh, whatever. Uh, and glass, be able to make glass now, and blood rose potion. Nice. Noish, noish, noish. Then um, I'm going to get the cyclone because I wanted to try that out. I'm going to try that out this time. I do like the ore, but I want to try it out the cyclone. So in any event, I think. Well, hold on. Let's see. Bane of Shadow Blade. Oh, he, you can make slashers. Oh. We got to kill this guy. All right. I was going to end the video, but I want to kill this guy because we can get human form after that, which then we can be a good disguise for us. It's not too far away, so let's head over there. Hold on. Don't tell me this person right here, is it? No, it can't be right. You yep, it is. Holy shit. Enemy. That was really cool. I didn't expect that. Let's try to cycle it out. Ah! 
I don't know if I like cyclists. Oof. This okay. is the eternal night. It just comes back. I don't know if I like that. Look I'll kill my horse. Or I will kill you. I'm gonna kill you anyway. Oh shit! What is this? Oh. Oh fuck. Let me switch my ever living to me. Oh, it's him. Interesting fight so far. Into the dark. Oh lord, I just used it too far. I need to do that. dead. Eat it. Good fight, but I need that blood, buddy. We are eternal. That was a cool fight. All right. And what did we required. get with this? All right. Once a formidable swordsman and legendary grave robber, Bane was caught by the cult of the damned during one of his many heists. Seeing the benefit of his, his talent for infiltration, instead of killing him, they corrupted him into a servant of undeath. It's said that his clandestine abilities were crucial in the capture and the corruption of the iron mine over the militia. Nice. So we got another unholy spell point, and the big one, two big ones are we can now Turn into a human to sneak around and notice in human settlements. Be careful though, the strong world can see through your disguise, while in human form you can interact with traitors. Human form greatly increases blood consumption rate. Ooh. Also, we unlock the ability to craft slashers. So, before we head back, I'm going to, I think we're close to, I'm going to head to this merchant real quick. And can we transform now? Yes, we can. From flesh to shadow. What are we gonna transform look like? Oh, we just have a cloak on our head. Okay. Can we ride our horse with this? I don't I don't think so, but I'm gonna try anyway. Again, okay. Alright, as for spells. I, I the only one we can use by is the this one corrupted skull, which is fine. All right, let's head to see if we could buy shit. Luckily, I brought my money too, so I've been wanting to spend it this whole time. All right, let's try this out. Don't worry, don't mind us. We're just coming through to you know buy some stuff. No mind us. Blood reserves run low. Oh, fuck. I need blood. Right, let's make this quick. What you got over here? Rural goods merchant. Yeah, enjoy my humble Airhead shop. sage. I actually want to buy a lot of this fish. Thick leather. I need dirt. However, I want to find the book merchant. That's the one I really wanted. Have a look at my wares. 
Have a look at my wares. Okay. Do we have library food? We, we, we do, okay. I remember buying that. Iron longbow, yes. I was going to purchase that. And then... Ooh, they have a lot of good stuff here. That's the one I really wanted. Um, I don't think I could buy anything else. It's all good. If you can't buy anything here, my no. Well, we can. Thick leather, actually. I did want. Badly. You know what? I want to buy the thick leather. I think that's all we can buy right now. Well, that's all I'm going to buy right now. Uh, it's no other. The gem merchant, but... I think we are fine with what we have. Yeah, let's just head back now. It's good to know. Um, This place takes silver instead of copper, so... Alright, we are back here in our castle. And I believe we are going to call it, although first I want to put all this stuff into the study. The longbow, which I very much wanted. Blood Hunter chest guard. <sighs> oh, I want to make that. I'm going to make that. Alright. Thick leather. I only have one, but it is what it is. Um, okay. Well, in any event, I think we're going to stop right here. So, we've done a lot. We've killed, let's see how many people we killed. We killed one, two, three, four, five, six, six B blood targets, which is wonderful. And so, in the next episode, I'm Pretty sure we're going to be heading into this tier of enemies, which they look formidable just by looking at them. Holy shit. Terra, the Geomancer. Frostmaw, the Mountain Terror. What? What? General Elena, the Hollow. Oh, we're going to be dealing with a lot of undead individuals. Wait, use to unlock and infuse your vampire with passive powers. What? Really? Cool. Um, thick leather, that's how we unlock the thick leather. Okay, mountain peak bag, get a bigger bag, and siege golem stone. What? What? Okay, this is getting crazy what we can unlock. Gem cutting table, okay. Well, yeah. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please like the video, subscribe to the channel. We're getting very close to 500 subscribers. We're less than, I believe, 20. So I'm definitely wanting to hit 500 by hopefully mid-June. It'll be really nice. So then we can get our first reward within the YouTube partnership. But yeah, until next time, take care. Bye.